Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. Well, hello there, my beautiful Pisces. I hope you are all having a fantabulous time. So, my beautiful Pisces, thank you for all the beautiful likes, the comments, the shares, the subscriptions, the donations to my channel. It is greatly appreciated and well received more than you will ever know. So, Pisces, before we get into the reading, as usual, I will be putting down the good old-fashioned holy water. I guess at the end of the month, Thanksgiving week, I'm flying out to North Carolina, Raleigh, North Carolina, and I'm <laughs> Louie. He's like, ah, oh, the Pisces hasn't seen me in a week, Mama. He's like, I'm so excited to see the Pisces. I'm so excited, my Pisces Mama's back. I'm just gonna lay on the cards. No, come on, Louie. I know. He's like, I cleanse the cards. Come on, Vinny. Come on, get down. He's so cute. Yeah, so I'm going to be watching my friend's cat that I just left. Or my friend Rick. Yeah, I'm going to be watching his cat. Florence, which is Louie's soulmate. You know, she runs from him and uh, he doesn't understand it. So, anyway, Pisces. <laughs> That's why he loves the tarot. Because he's like trying to find out about Florence. <laughs> you know what time it is. Tarot's noun session. Most Honorable Judge T. T. Doan presiding. You may all do whatever you want. My cat setter did a fabulous job, I might say. I'm so happy with that. So, we're going to check in on the energy of that person you're dealing with, or whatever energy could be potentially approaching you. Like I always tell you, it could very well be your own energy. <laughs> whatever the case is, we will get it. We will hit it. And we will quit that shit together, just like we always do, baby. Yeah, yeah. And then I think, I know, I'm just going to be using up a lot. I have a ton of vacation saved. A ton. A ton. Like a ton, ton, ton. And I might be going out to Kentucky, too, to go see my friend Rick's girlfriend. Before I fly out, he flies me out to Raleigh. Yeah, I'm just like, you know what? Before winter sets in, I just need to be free. I just need... I need, I need vacation. I might as well, I've saved all this vacation. My boss is totally cool with me using the vacation. So I'm like, cool. Yeah, I got a pretty cool boss. <sighs> Show me the energy of the person, my beaut. Okay. Oh, brother. Your person, all they want to do right now is they want to quit crying. They've been crying about something. Oh, Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. Okay. I feel like this person is about to do something unexpected and absolutely shocking. I feel like they're wanting to give you something here, too. Okay. Sure. Okay. And whatever the case is, it looks like you make this person happy. Uh, something's going on with their subconscious, though, to where it's like they're feeling kind of like rotten, okay? Like they're falling apart. They feel like they've kind of fallen, they've been falling apart. They've been crying. Okay. So your person's feeling like a, what, a soggy old pumpkin on a November day that's been carved that has never been removed from somebody's front porch right now. So that's not necessarily good. Oh my God, Bailiff, you're so cute. Mommy just missed you. Oh, so cute. I can tell he's just so happy. Okay, so what's this person? Oops. Okay, the Ace of Wands came out. I'm putting that in. I wasn't ready. Okay, everything's starting to flick out here for me. All right, what's going on here? I'm not ready. What's this person been crying over here? What's this person been crying over? What have they been crying over with the Ten of Pentacles, please? Pisces, what have you done to this person? I feel like somebody here, not only is this person obsessed with you, but they've been crying because it looks like you guys aren't in a serious relationship here. Or it could be a toxic one. Let's find out. 
What is this? What is this? What is this? Is this a series or is it a toxic? Let's see. No. This person's been crying because you guys aren't in a serious relationship. That's exactly what's going on here. So they've been crying because you guys are not in a serious relationship. So why is this person so upset that they like about not being with Pisces? Why is this person so upset about not being with Pisces here? My deck's starting to go crazy back here. Why is this person so obsessed with not being in a serious relationship with Pisces? Why, why, why are they upset that they're not? Okay. Because something is keeping this person stuck. What's keeping this person stuck? What's keeping this person stuck? Oh, boy. Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. Okay, King of Cups. He loves, right? He doesn't always know how to love, though. Okay, he's... he. So, what's keeping this person stuck is that they're struggling with their emotions. So, they could be a little bit more more emotionally immature than you. And so you as a Pisces probably more than likely don't struggle with your emotions. So you're probably not even considering this person to be a candidate at this point when this person sees you as a candidate, but they've got to open up. Okay. So you're probably not gonna try to open this person up because you're probably like, well, I've been through enough relationships in my life. I'm looking for somebody that knows what they want and is just going to come in and tell me how they feel. Which is, which is, I understand that too. Okay. So, what's this shocking thing that's about ready to happen here? What's the shocking thing that's about ready to happen? What's this shocking thing that's about ready to happen, please? What's this shocking thing that's about ready to happen, please? What is this? Okay, let me get one more on that. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I feel like they're going to come in and tell you some kind of truth here is what I'm getting. And it's about how they want to take a risk towards you, take a gamble. But this person feels like they're just going to fuck things up. So why is this person going to tell Pisces? Why are, what, what's going on here? What's going on here? Yeah. They're going to tell you, they're going to tell you something here, Pisces, about taking a risk towards you and how they screwed up. But this person, honestly, they, they kind of puff themselves up. But when they get there, it's like this, they don't really know how to talk. Okay, so then this person... Uh, uh, they're coming in, right? Like a powerhouse. I'm going to fucking do this. So they're like, I'm going to fucking do this. I'm going to come in. I'm going to shock Pisces with this. And then they're like, oh, fuck. I don't know how to fucking tell Pisces anything. So it's like they're not very... This person is emotionally imbalanced. They don't have a lot of real emotional... It's there, but it's like getting it into words is another story. Oh, brother Pisces. Okay. All right, we're going to talk to the sun. Oh, my God, Pisces. So this is like one of those firecrackers, right? You ever buy a firecracker at the freaking crap firecracker place? And then the next thing you know, it's a dud. So, this person's a little bit of a dud when it comes to speaking. 
So what's going on with the sun and the chariot? We know this person is like being forced to do something here. And there's a lot of anxiety here, but it's like the universe is pulling them to do something. What the hell are they getting ready to do? So they're going to invite you over. Why is this person going to invite Pisces? So they're getting, they're like, oh, I don't know. Maybe I should just invite Pisces. Why are they inviting Pisces over? Because they're wanting to give you something. And it's tying over here. So what is this person wanting to give Pisces? What is this person wanting to give Pisces here? Oh, shit. Oh, I don't think it's going to be a neat. I feel like they kind of... They kind of... This person, like, wants to give you something, but then it's like, I don't know. I don't know if I should do this. Yeah. Yeah. So they have this big energy, and it's like the universe is like... So when you get to their house, or they invite you out, or whatever they're getting ready to do, and then they go to give you something, then it's like... Oh, fuck. I don't know. I don't know. Like, I, I don't think I, I, I just, no, I just, I shouldn't. Oh my God. Pisces. What the fuck is wrong with these people? Can't we just get the kitty, unicorn, fairy, boom, boom, stardust, pixie, troll land? Oh, I get back home and this is what I get? This is what the Pisces get? And I got to give this reading? Jesus. Jesus Christ. You guys remember South Park, the guy that's slave? Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Tarot's adjourned.